Giovanni Boccaccio's De Camerone is a classic of European literature dating back to the 14th century. It contains exactly 100 short stories covering all aspects of human life. Some of the stories have uh, explicit erotic content and they tell us about the life of, for example, priests, clergymen, monks and nuns in the 14th century Italy. And these erotic stories is perhaps the reason why Catholic Church decided to ban this book in the 16th century. It was added to the so-called index list of bad books by the church. But what is somewhat surprising is that even in our times, modern times, De Camerone has been censored. It was more or less banned in some parts of the United States and even in Britain in the 1940s and 1950s. And also here in Finland, as late as in the beginning of the 1960s, you could not get it freely from public libraries. It was only for adults, and even among adults it was selectioned who could get it from the library. Now I will read you the end of one of the stories. Then, being minded that Sultan's first intent to wit, that his daughter should be the bride of the king of Algarm, should not be frustrated, he wrote to the king, telling him all, and adding that if he were still minded to have her, he might send for her. The king was overjoyed by these tidings, and having sent for her with great pomp, gave her on her arrival a hearty welcome. So she, who had lain with eight men, in all perhaps ten thousand times, was bedded with him as a virgin, and made him believe that the virgin she was, and lived long and happily with him as his queen. Wherefore it was said, Mouth for kisses was never the worse, like as the moon reneweth her course.